I got some free pallets here, guys, and I have some ideas. Uh, some ideas and projects I would like to do, but I don't like to spend a lot of money. So let's see what I can do with the free stuff before I have to start spending money and other stuff to make this be stuff. <laughs> I guess it would be. <laughs> Stay tuned, guys, because I don't know what I'm going to do with all these pallets. But I know I want to do something with them. And uh, hopefully I can even get some more. <laughs> all right, let's see what we can do with free pallets. Look at this, guys. I just got another thing of pallets. Uncle just dropped off another thing of pallets for me. Free pallets, guys. It's the second stack of free pallets. And I'm gonna drag them all the way to the back of the house and put them in the back. All right, so this is another step. And I told him that I'd be okay with what I have here. And we're gonna work with what we have before I need any more. But he told me that if I need more, just let him know. He's, he can get me free pallets anytime I need. I said, thumbs up. Thank you so much, uncle, for helping me out on this project even deliver them for free for me. Family's awesome, and that's the wife's uncle too. That's not even my, that's my wife's uncle that I'm asking these favors for. Yeah, thanks uncle. All right, peeps, this is my free pallets here. All right, and what am I doing with my pallets? I don't know. I just know that I have to do something with them, right? So I'm starting to break them down, and I'm gonna show you how I'm breaking down these pallets that I got free, okay? Uh, I got one here, upside down. Uh, these are already broke down the way I want them, I guess, see? These metal pieces, these pieces here, are all those that was in here. So this is the top half, and that is the bottom half. And those are also a part of the bottom half that fell off when you start taking apart the bottom to take these pallets. These pallets that's whole, got to do something with them. See, I'm already using scrap wood to hold up my little iPad here because I don't have a camera. I don't have uh, stands and all that good stuff yet. I'm still using my cell phone and my little iPad thingy here for me to help record my adventures of uh, DIYing and learning to do stuff myself. So I decided to bring you guys along on my journey. I've never... here that I got and I have I need to do something with them. Now I don't have a truck uh, but I do know people with trucks and I also know people that when, um, when uh, if you know people with trucks uh, that work with their trucks usually if you if you if you're really good friends with them I was um, I'm, this was family that helped me with this uh, uh, you can ask them, hey, do you know how to get free pallets? Most of them will know how to get you hook, get you to hook up on free pallets if you need free pallets. But you know, most people don't don't do this. So people don't even know that you can get free stuff like this and then try to do something with it. So what am I gonna do with it? I, I really don't know. I just know I want to do something. So I said, uh, hey, Unc, uh, I'm trying to do a project. Can you bring me some uh, some free pallets? He goes, yeah, I got free pallets right here because uh, he works in a warehouse. I said, oh, okay, well, whenever you want, you just bring me some, no worries. Before I know it, he was driving up with free pallets. And then uh, he says, if I need more, uh, he'll bring more. I said, all right, go ahead and bring me another stack whenever you're ready, no worries. Before I know it, he came back with another one. And, I, and I, I'm going to share that with you guys. So thank you, Unc. It's the wife, Unc, that helped me out with these free pallets. He even dropped them off for me for free. Can't complain. Can't be uh, mad at that. So... What am I doing here? Ah, jeez. I'm trying to take these things apart. This is a slow process.
It's not easy. Number one, just little by little. rubber handle because it's really heavy and uh, I'm using them so I don't have to make so much noise and, uh, and uh, trying to be courteous of my neighbors kind of you know but look, 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 look when I, the difference when I hit it with the heavy duty hammer here uh -huh. that's heavy duty right there and I don't need to you know I fucking use the the rubber and it'd be quieter when I use the rubber. Whoops. <laughs> Put that wrong way down. <laughs> Breaking down all these pallets and I'm not recording nothing, man. I, 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 I'm, I, if I'm going to be in, a, in this uh, recording content and sharing it to the world, I need to record everything, even the boring stuff. Right, guys? <laughs> I'm sure everybody's going to watch this. Okay. Workhorses that I'm using with them, using these pallets, and I've used so many projects on them. And uh, I saved these pallets from a work site that uh, that they used it for the project that they were doing it for for that job, and they just build them, use them, and throw them away. Just get rid of it. And I'm like, hey, can I have them? And they're like, can I take it? And they're like, yeah, go ahead. Okay, we're well, about to throw it away. I'm like, all right, I got it. That was over 15 years ago since I've had these workhorses, and I'm still using them. They, <laughs> you, you say that they more than pay for themselves. <laughs> My workhorses more than pay for themselves, that's for sure. in the beginning. I haven't done it lately, but I want to hit my hands. <laughs> there you go. So this is how we this is how we do it. Alright. That's how I do it. Let's see. I get that down. Alright, now I want to flip it over. It's hot out here, guys. It's hot out here today. Mosquitoes are not having no mercy on me. Uh, even with me. All the spray. So now that I flipped it upside down, I need to remove these. Right? Okay. 
What is that one? Come on. all the stuff and all these in the box. And I'm gonna throw, throw some of the broken ones in that little box over there. I already got them stacked in there. Get them out of the way so they're not dropping all over the floor. Alright, so now that I've gotten it half open, I take the real hammer now. This is when I take the real hammer. And I try to put the nails into that. Have all the nails. I need, I need these nails out. Alright. It's starting to rain. Oh, it's starting to rain. My dogs are outside. Let me go get them inside. Oh my goodness. Alright, no worries. Got them all inside. They didn't get wet. All right, let's finish this thing up here. So, this, where am I? I'm trying to get the nails out now. Now, this is when I have to use this thing and make some noise. Let's go closer. Make some noise. So, trial and error. Take your time. Whew. Did I already knock these out? I thought I knocked these down already. Did they come back? Hey, that's not cool. No double, no double. Right. Now, I flip it over again. So now, I've learned that a hammer alone can't take it out. Let's see. Oh, wait, never mind. All right, now, um, where's my phone? I have a bucket of nails that I've already been saving. Here, give me a second here. I think I forgot to bring the nail bucket out. Okay, so, the, the nail bucket. Now this was an empty container when I first got it, when I first started. And it's got some really good nails. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, got some nails in there now. Rusted all, but still, it's in there. Trying to save them, not let them fall everywhere on the floor. So, as soon as I take one out, I put it in the bucket. So this nail pulling time. Some nails are easier to take out than others. This is this nailer, this puller is different. When I use this, I can't use it by itself. But with conjunction with this and this, just put it on a little point, boom. And I can use it like that. But why use two when you can just use the one hammer, big, big daddy hammer, and just, and just take it. Break on me. 
Got it out. Like I said, some of them come out so easy, and some of them are supposed to be difficult. Man. All right, see? Now look at this one. First one I never broke. So that's the individual piece, right? The individual piece that we have stacked over here. It's my first one that ever broke like that. So maybe we can use a piece off of it for some scrap or something, but right now I'm just saving all the good ones. All the good ones. So there we go. Let's take this rest of these nails out here. You guys can see what I'm doing. Like I said, I don't have a camera set up. I can't, I can't see what you guys are seeing until after I record it and then go back and check it. But it doesn't have a screen for me to see this side. Ooh, there we go. Look at that. Look at that. See that? It's so easy. Look at that. This one. This one feels like I could take it out with my, with my fingers if I knocked it out. Ha! See? That's a clean piece right there. Put it over there. When I check this piece, all the nails are out that's sticking out. And that's a good piece right there. Alright, so I put this over here. And now, still have this piece. All I gotta do is take the nails out. and you don't want me to leave it in there, I'm sure, huh? So I could step on it or something. Anyways, there we go. There's another one, but it splits. So I'm going to put that aside. We're not clean, clean. Now I'm going to let these nails loose here. Take these off. Okay. I don't want no nails inside the box either, so when they're in there, I'm trying to walk them around and loosen them up. I'm trying to take them out as well. So all the blocks will have no nails. Everything is clean, no nails. All these nails sticking up. When you're knocking the nails down, you got to make sure nothing is stopping it from coming down on the roof. So, you're wondering why it's not coming down because something is stopping it. You got a block under there that's stopping it from going down. That's why. Block in. <laughs> that's it, guys. This is a boring one. This is a boring one. This is not even what I'm going to do with the pallets. This is just me prepping my pallets. For whatever I'm gonna do with it. You know? Get a loose nail. Got it? Got it? Make sure all the nails are secure. Don't let, them, don't let them go rampant everywhere. Okay. Every time I step, I want to step on a piece of block with a, a nail in it or a piece of wood with a nail in it. So I take my time, work one piece at a time, one pallet at a time, and I make sure that I, I collect all the nails. And uh, maybe what I'm going to do with these pallets, 
uh, maybe I use these rusty nails to do the, the project because it's going to be an outside project. It's not going to be an inside project. Maybe I can recycle some of these rusty nails and screws that I took off of my deck that I got new screws for instead of putting those rusty screws back in. Look at that, it's nice and clean there. Alright, so now it's almost clean guys. This pallet is almost finished prepping for where I want to prep it. I just need to take these screws out now. Can you still see? Okay, got it. Without me blocking. <laughs> oh, I left the block for you guys. Right, let's put this back in here. We drink so much coffee that we throw away these containers. I throw away so many of those containers that I decided to start saving them, some of them, to use them for projects like this. And look at this. There's another container of this of rusty nail collecting from each individual project. So I'm just going in the landfill. I'm using it for a purpose. A second purpose. So now I'm going to fill, make sure all the wood is on kind of there. But when I start building, anything that's loose, I need an extra screw up, put in or nail, or whatever. You know? So hey, okay. look, it's clean. All the nails are out. Now I stack this over here. And that is how I'm breaking down these pallets, guys. All right, so, see, and I still have one, two, three, four, five left. This is my little work area. It's a mess, I know, I am so sorry. I'm working on trying to make it nicer. Here they are, the top halves that are already broken down, your bottom halves, and all the middle pieces. So, I'm out here and I'm doing work. I'm taking my time, I'm not rushing, I'm just doing a little here, a little there, uh, but I'm getting it done. So thanks guys for watching my channel. I hope I deserve a thumbs up to show you what, if you know someone with a truck, even if you don't have a truck, uh, free pallets are out there and you can get them if you know how to, you know, ask for them. <laughs> I didn't, it didn't even take me long. I made one phone call and that first phone call, he said, no problem. And boom, look at that. So, yeah, thanks guys for watching my channel. I know this one is a boring video, but there it is. I got to I got to put content out there. All right? And uh, I hope you're excited to see what I'm going to do with these free pallets uh once I have uh, transformed them into something else. Uh, <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh, and here's the nails. These are all the nails that I've already gotten out of these pallets. Yep, all of these nails is from all those pallets that are already broken down. This was an empty container. Yeah, believe it. All right, let me go ahead and continue doing one at a time <laughs> till they're all done. And then I can move on to the next step of projects. And hopefully one day I can clean this up. I'm gonna, I gotta, this area is my work area and this here is, is hard. It's getting, it's, it's getting horrible, horrible more and more every day. And it's raining again. I need to clean this up. So maybe I'll put this in a project and how I can make this area nicer. So when I'm working here, I'm not working in a mud pit <laughs> in my little small work area. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. This is my this is a little piece of my inside. <laughs>